Hello, thank you for tuning into my channel and we have a very, very much regressive video. Handbag collection video and I've taken all of my handbags out of my closet. And I am going to show you all of them, where I got them, all of that stuff. You're going to hear me say Forever 21 a lot, okay? Um, and you're also going to hear, see me show a lot of bags that Forever 21 does not have anymore. The thing with Forever 21 is that they rotate through bags on their site and in their store all the time. So some of these bags I got years ago, some of these bags I got recently, and they don't even have them on the site anymore. Um, two of them I will show you and I will let you know if they have them in the store. But a majority of the bags I have, I'm going to show you, Forever 21 does not have anymore. Um, and it is what it is. But I am going to show you what I have in my collection. And I thought that I would kind of just go through and show you the mini bags, then the medium size and the large. And we'll just go from smallest to biggest. So I have them here on my bed and we're just going to get started with all of this. The first bag I'm going to show you, oh my god, still tangled up, um, is this bag right here that I got from Forever 21 about maybe two years ago or whatever. They don't have this particular style anymore, but they have it with this style with a gold chain. As you can see, this has the gun metal on here, which I love. And it does have a strap on here this just like this okay where is the other part okay you can wear it like this or you can wear it you know like that so you can wear it cross body you can wear it in the crook of your arm you can wear it as a clutch with the straps in the inside but if you wear it like that it's going to limit you on the amount of space you have inside the bag but i like this bag for um you know like date nights or just running a couple of errands and you don't want to take everything with you these charms right here I got at Walmart. It's one charm and it has three pom-poms connected to it. And that is clipped on the bag because you guys know I love bag charms. Another bag I got recently from Forever 21 is one just like it, which is the pink bag. And I won't take the strap out of it because you guys saw the last one. This charm I got at Walmart. And Forever 21 does still have this bag along with the black one with the gold on it. But I recently got this one. I haven't used it yet. I really love this color pink. So... This one was like 19 bucks, not too bad. This one uh, I got a while back at Forever 21 and I love it because it does have three zippers on here and there's three different compartments. Um, you can put cards in here. Um, so you can basically like use this as your wallet plus your purse. So you don't have to put a wallet in here. And this is a great bag if you want to put this inside of a bigger bag. Say you're going to work and you're going like out after work. This is a great bag to carry. It's crossbody. The strap does not come off, so you can't wear it as a clutch. But I love it as I'm wearing just a crossbody bag. It's great for traveling too. Um, next bag is this one right here. I got from Forever 21. Not that long ago, maybe about a month and a half ago, and they don't have it anymore. Um, it came with the pom poms on the bag, and I put this strawberry charm on here that I got from Walmart. And I thought it just really fit really nicely. It's a mini bag. The strap does come off. I love this because I don't have a bright red bag in my collection. This is the only one. It's small, but it does fit quite a bit for it to be so small. And then this one I just got recently. I got it the same day I got that pink bag I showed. And it's this little bucket bag right here. I really, really love this bag. I wore it... Um, when I first got it, I wore it for like three days in a row, and I switched out to another bag that I'll show you. But this, the strap right here does come off. The long strap does not. I added this charm um, that I got from Walmart, and it's, um, it cinches up like this. I showed this in a live stream, and the recollections, um, per personal recollections planner does fit in here. It just it stays open. Um, and then the personal zip one fits in here, and I have a little bit more space. But I love this bag because it fits a ton of stuff. Um, and you wouldn't think so. And the inside does have a pocket and it has like this pink suede on the inside. So I really love that bag. Uh, another bag from Forever 21 is this one right here. It came with the white pom-pom, but I added this one and this bear from Walmart. These two are from Walmart. I love this bag because this fits a ton of stuff. The strap does come off and um, it's black in the inside. But I love this bag because I can carry a lot of stuff in it, but it's not too big. So it's great for dressing up, dressing down. You can wear it crossbody, 
You, so you can wear it a few different ways. And so we're gonna move on to some of my medium size bags. And this one I got from Forever 21 around the same time I got that small black one. And I love it because it reminds me of Chanel. And it's really nice. I haven't had any problems with it. I keep the strap in here too. This one is a little bit more structured. Um, it does have two pockets in here like this and I just keep the strap in there. There's a zip pocket and there's a pocket right here. But I, I really like this because I like wearing this like when I'm, you know, dressed up. But you can wear it very casual. I mean, I'm a fan of buying bags where you can wear them with any outfit that you own. But um, love this one right here. And another one, I got this bag from a, a site called ShopSueyBoutique.com. And I got this one. This one reminds me of a Chanel bag too. Um, this one is really structured. And I keep the strap in there and it opens up just like that and it has a zipper pocket. This one doesn't fit a ton of stuff because it's not very stretchy. So some bags that are stretchy you can fit more stuff, but this one doesn't really fit a ton of stuff. But um, I love carrying this like when I have day nights. This is a Mother's Day gift from my husband this year. And moving on, I got this bag from Forever 21 years ago, like a long time ago. It looks like this and like I cut this right here because the straps were through here. And anytime I wanted to wear the bag different ways, it was like a struggle. So I was like, I'll just cut this and whatever. Um, so I can wear it like this or I can wear it like that. And it's very soft and opens up like that. You can fit quite a bit in here. So I love like the illusion of bags looking like they only fit a little bit, but they fit quite a bit. So that is that. And then we have a bag right here that I got from a site called bagink.com. And if you're looking for really nice designer inspired bags, I'm talking about bags that look so good they almost look like the real bag. That is a site to go to. I got this one years ago, probably like in 20, 2012 or 2013 or something like that. Um, it looks like the Mulberry Alexa bag and it's real leather. I paid like 85 bucks. That is like the most I pay for like a non-designer bag. Um, but the strap does come off. You can wear it a few different ways because of the way the strap is. You can adjust it to any length. Um, and there's a back pocket and like my jeans did rub off on there. Um, and it opens up like this. This is, to me, I call this like, it's a very, very casual bag. I like wearing it crossbody. It's one of those, like, if I just have on jeans and a t-shirt and I really like wearing that bag. Um, another bag is, I got this when Neiman Marcus teamed up with Target, which was like their <laughs> worst collaboration ever. Um, this bag went to retail that was like 60 bucks and I was not gonna pay that much for a Target bag, I don't care. But like the next week I went back and got it for 30. Um, you can't really see it, but it does have these flowers on it, which is nice. Like this is a bag I only use when I'm dressed up because of the flower design. Um, it does have, you know, the feet on the bottom. It does have two, four separate pockets in here and two zip pockets. So there is a lot of organization in this bag. I really like it. It is kind of dirty. Um, I don't know how I can actually clean this bag or not, but, um, very structured bag and it does come unsnapped. So you can put a little bit more stuff in there. Um, this bag right here is from Forever 21. I love this bag. The only thing I don't like is that there's no pockets on the inside. So it's just completely open, but I love it. And you can, it comes with a belt right here, a strap. So I like wearing it, you know, cross body like this and like right in the front so I can reach everything. But this is a good bag if you just wanna grab stuff in your bag and not worry about anything. And I got this years ago, so you guys know Forever 21 doesn't have it anymore. So I'm gonna move on to some clutches that I have. I only have two clutches. I'm not huge on clutches because you have to hold them. And so I only really wear clutches when I go out with my husband, like on a date night or something. This one I got from Target earlier this year. And um, it is by the company Who What Wear. And it looks like this. I love this. It came with this tassel and it folds over like this. It has this sway, but you can do, you can wear it like this. You can fit, you know, quite a bit of stuff in here. Like if you don't have a big wallet, but I usually just carry like my keys, my phone, and like a compact so I can check my makeup. I don't carry a ton of stuff in here. And I don't know if this is still available at Target. I know at the time when I got it, they had like an army green color, which was really cute. And then this clutch right here, which is huge. Huge, it fits my MacBook. Um, 
I got this on Forever 21 um, years ago. They had it in the clearance bin. And I paid like two bucks or something for it. Um, no, no, it wasn't even that expensive. <laughs> it was like 50 cents. And it was only one left. And so I snatched it up because I didn't have like a cobalt blue bag in my collection. And I did put this charm on here from Walmart. I thought it matched perfectly because there wasn't anything, there wasn't any flair with this bag or anything at all. So I like having this little charm on here because it looks like it belongs with the bag. So that's it for clutch. I'm going to get on to the medium, the medium size bags. Well, more medium. Um, this is a bag. I can't believe I've been carrying this bag with the price tag on it. <laughs> um, this bag, as you all know, is from Recollections and I am loving this bag. You guys saw all the stuff I could fit in it. And I did put this uh, pom-pom on here from Walmart. These two are from Walmart and I thought they matched perfectly with the bag. It has the four pockets. I do have a couple of pens and I'm just using it as a purse because I think it's really cute and yeah, but I can't fit all my planner stuff in here if I want to. Bag I'm currently using, this is at Michael's. I think it's 35 bucks, but you can use a coupon, obviously. Um, next up is this backpack my husband got for me from H&M in Vegas last year for our anniversary. So I've had it um, a little over a year, but it's very nice and soft. It's very plushy. And so I did add this um, pom pom right here in his little purse. I thought these two colors looked really nice against the black. And uh, I like using this when I, when I travel. I do plan on taking this with me when I go to Disneyland. That way I'm completely hands-free. Um, but yes, I love using this for traveling. Another bag I got from Forever 21. I got this years ago. It's one of my favorite bags. And it is this duffel style bag. It reminds me of the Alexander Wang Rocco bag. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you can Google it. Um, but it's like a duffel right here. There is a, the strap does not come off, but I always use it. You can wear it cross, but it, it's a very long bag. As you can see, it goes down all the way, like past my hips. But I love that because it, it kind of gets like that quote unquote messy look for lack of a better word. But um, the straps are adjustable and you can unzip these sides to give you more space. I just keep them unzipped because I always have a ton of stuff in my bag. Next up is this bag, this Juicy Couture bag. I got this from Plato's Closet back in 2008. <laughs> so I've had it for a really, really long time. Um, it's a real juicy bag. I only pay $40 for it. I think this bag retail for like $250 and I would never pay that much for this bag. But it's really cute. I haven't worn it in a while, but it's a bag I refuse to get rid of. Um, but it's really, really cute. It does have, um, you know, I guess you can do something with this pom-pom if I really wanted to. But you know, it has the typical bow on here with the pocket and it, the, the inside is really cute it does have a hook for your keys and it's a very fun inside where you know it says shop on the pocket and then the other pocket says um hello so like as you can see like it's all torn up but i've had it for a long time um next my last no no not my last bag from forever 21 this gray bag i got from forever 21 i mean years ago years and it just started tearing up, but I've had this bag for like nine years. So this gray bag right here, this is a bag I used faithfully every single day for years. Like I refused to, if I switch bags, I would switch back to it the next day. Um, you can wear it in like this where it's shaped like a trapezoid, but I really don't. Uh, it has, it's a lot of room in here, a lot of pockets, but I love it because it's a good color that matches everything. And then this bag right here is a Tory Burch bag. I got this at the Goodwill for $2.50. It is a real Tory Burch bag. Um, I was comparing pictures and everything and I even had somebody um, authenticate it for me while I was in the Goodwill. I was in there for a while. And she said, yeah, it's real. And so um, I love it. I love using it when I travel because I can fit, I usually put like all my toiletries and everything in this bag because it does have organization and hair tools and everything and so. I love using it. It is a beach tote, and I think this bag retailed for like 300 bucks. But yes, it's really nice. Then another bag I got, I got this for free from Sports Chalet. They sent me a coupon, and I just <laughs> I ordered this bag. It's cute. It's a cute little book tote with um, anchors on it. I mean, it's, if you want to use it as a planner tote, I could. But I don't really use this. I guess I could use it for shopping. <laughs> I, I'm going to throw it in the trunk of my car and use it if I need a shopping tote. But there's no pockets or organization in here. I, I just thought it was a cute little fun bag to order. Uh, next up is this bag right here. I don't know how 
old you guys are, but there, when Gwen Stefani had partnered with the company with Sports App to create a handbag line called Lamb, she does have Lamb bags now, but they're much more expensive. Um, she created a lot of bags, and I've had this bag for years, and it's a bag that I use for traveling because it's so huge. Like when I have to put my daughter's toiletries and stuff in one big bag in mine, I put it in here because it is nylon, so if something spills on it, it's gonna come out. It did have a charm, a little lamb on it, um, but I lost it. And on the bag it says, where did my lamb go? And it's in Gwen Stefani's handwriting. And it's huge, it has this huge pocket in here and two other pockets, but I, I love this bag just for traveling purposes. And almost done. This bag I got from when Philip Lim teamed up with Target. I do have two Philip Lim shirts and um, I got this bag, I think it was like 40 bucks or something, and I love it. It's a great like business tote. I don't use it much anymore because I don't carry a ton of stuff, but at a time, I think one time I had to take my planner with me somewhere, and I used this is a great business bag if you want it. If you want a, like a good planner tote, I like this one because it's not too huge, but it looks professional. So, um, I mean, you can't buy it anymore, but it's just, um, if you guys want to buy a, a tote that does not look like a planner tote like look in department stores for tote bags with lots of pockets so that one last bag is one I got a while back from forever 21 and this is a good planner tote too sadly they don't have it anymore it's a nice black professional bag that's really nice and then you have this bright red inside it does come with a um, inside pocket that is removable so you can put it in different bags if you want and it does have two pockets and a zip pocket in the inside if you take this pocket out there's no organization so this is like your main organization but it does separate the two um so i really like it it's like this red suede i know it's not real suede because it, it would be more than 30 bucks if it was but um yeah that is my last bag i love this bag usually when i'm going to if I know I'm going to like Michael's or something, I will take this bag because we have a, a law here in California where um, you have to bring your own bags to the store, pay for them. So I like using this to carry stuff in. So that is my entire handbag collection. And now I gotta put all these bags back. But I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments about anything that I've mentioned in this video, leave them down below. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, sus subscribe <laughs> to my channel. So with that said, I'm going to get out of here and I will see you all next time. Bye.